Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and somebody's trying to invert this picture from this to this to run on a a black um, Yeti type cup tumbler type deal, and she had a a file that I couldn't do anything with. It was a weird file, so I had her send me the clip art. And you can see it's a clip art. And in this particular case, we don't have to convert it to a bitmap. We're going to resample it. I've already turned it to 300 and then go to trace bitmap, outline trace clip art. I find works the best. And there's a few tricky steps in there, but it's almost done. And you hit OK. And then here is our item. So that's exactly like she has. Now, I'm gonna put that in the center of the page. Let's get that clipboard out of the way. And I'm gonna to go to find and replace, which find and replace is under edit, find and replace, and this is 2019, it's a little bit different. Uh, I actually get it, but it's a little bit harder. A uniform color, then you need to click on the text, and we need to move our box out of the way, and we're gonna find a uniform color and even though this, whatever color is up there, you just take the eyedropper and put it to that black and thankfully they're all the same. And then hit okay and find all. Well, it found this up here. So I'm gonna have to delete our other dogs. Let's do it again, find all. And for some reason, it won't let me nudge it. Well, there it did. So it's working. Now, that is what she wants, or this is the opposite of what she wants. In this particular case, you can't really change the uh, color. And I'm gonna have to go to object and ungroup these two. And then I'm gonna left click, no fill, and right click. And then I'm gonna go ahead and make something other than a hairline and she's working in inches and I don't know, I'm gonna to go to points and go to two points and get a little definition. Then I'm gonna take the white and I'm gonna turn it black and then I'm gonna be able to nudge this back. I'll have to select it all. Select it all and then nudge this back. I personally don't think it uh, looks as good, but you never know till you really run it. And you might want to take this uh, line and make it a little bit thicker. That's too thick. Let's go four points. And that has inverted the colors, because if we bring the other one back in, um, whatever is white now is transparent, or whatever is white was was transparent and whatever is black is transparent. So sorry, whatever was white is now black, whatever is black is transparent. You're gonna lose a little definition. You know, I'm, I'm gonna have trouble making out that eye, but you really don't know till you run it. You know, she's running this on a black cup and I can see where that isn't gonna work. Um, you know, unless it's a powder coated cup and you're gonna take the powder coating off, all the black is gonna be taken away and all the the white is gonna be black. So this is right. This is the way she, you would want it. And I'm not even sure, you have to have that outline around there, but I would definitely test that. Maybe you want a piece of wood or something before you run it. But that's one way to do it. Hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.